Good morning. Thank you for the invitation to come and speak today. Like my colleagues before you and Darren, he joined the brigade, then his wife. Well, ours was different. I joined the auxiliary with some girlfriends and then Graham joined a little bit later. So we've been there probably about 33 years plus at the base and so we've enjoyed it. Our two children, when they became of age, also joined the juniors and went on to the senior ranks and they've thoroughly enjoyed their time as well. And I've been very fortunate, as Lex says, I've been in the colour party. I've been a founding member of the auxiliaries for Victoria and a state councillor. So there are two hens in the Chook House now, so the guys know that they're alive when we get to the meeting, which is really good. Graham and I, um, at one stage, Graham was at headquarters and was doing a lot of work, so when it came strike team, I would go off and the neighbours would go, oh, where are you going? Oh, I'm going to strike team. Where are you going, Graham? I'm going to work. <laughs> so I would pack my bag and off I'd go, he'd go to work. So it was a bit of a role reversal in our place and something that we've really enjoyed. Over the years, someone said to me, oh, do you get paid? No. Well, why do you do it? And with that, and I enjoy writing, I just wrote these few words, so mine will be very brief, and I'll just read you this poem that I wrote to, uh, as a volunteer. What is a CFA volunteer? A CFA volunteer is someone who volunteers their time to belong to an organisation that we are all very proud to be a member of. If you ask 100 members why they joined and why they remain in the CFA, then you probably get 100 different answers. But the common thread that runs through all of us is we belong because we can and because we want to. We are a strange breed of person to the outside world. We don't get paid, <coughs> excuse me, we give our time freely, weekends, nights, as they say, 24-7. We don't take holidays from the organisation. We leave our families and loved ones at the drop of a hat. We leave a nice warm bed. We leave that beautiful roast that's just been put on the table for us. And all because we are a CFA volunteer. We do our job. We return to the station. We restow the truck and put it away for the next call. And then we get on with whatever we were doing prior to the pager going off and the siren sounding. We all know that when we leave the station, we are putting our lives on the line for someone else in need. We don't look for accolades or the tag hero or parades or specially struck medals. We do it because we are able to. A simple thank you is enough and all because we are a CFA volunteer. Thank you.